Hey ladies, welcome back. First of all, I just want to say thank you so much. Um, if you like my Facebook page, if you subscribe to this channel, I really appreciate the support and your nice comments and the fact that you actually made the effort to come view my page and everything. I really appreciate it. So, um, I'm going to give you a hug. Is that okay? I'm going to give you a hug. Okay, without further ado, let's get right into the review. Obviously, you guys know by the title that I'm going to be doing a review on Ruby Woo, which is a MAC lipstick. Um, this is actually my very first MAC purchase. I'm very skeptical about MAC products sometimes because I feel like they're a little overpriced. I decided to give them a chance because everyone was raving about this lipstick, said it was so awesome. really like the matte finish, so that's what attracted me to purchase this lipstick. So I'm just going to show you what it looks like. It looks like this and it is just a matte red. That means no gloss. This is my mini demo. This is how it looks. I purchased this lipstick online and it retailed for about $15. A few things that I like about it. I like that it's true to its name, saying that it's matte. I like the color a lot. I think it's really pretty. Packaging's cute. Um, but honestly, I think that that's pretty much it. Because when it comes to things that I didn't really like about it, there's a little bit more. It's a little bit drying. Sort of like a stain would. A little too dry for my taste. It has a very sweet scent. And when it comes to things that smell really sweet, like makeup that smells really sweet, uh, I tend to not really like it as much. I think the color is gorgeous, but I don't know if it fits my taste as much. My skin color, I don't think it fits me as well. And for the last thing, I promise, when I put on this lipstick, um... It tends to not really fill out. <laughs> Normally, I guess that wouldn't matter because you don't directly see that. But sometimes when I talk or when I do certain things, like when I talk like when I talk like this, not that I really talk like that all the time, but sometimes it shows and it just looks like it's fading away like super fast and that sucks. That is it for this review, guys. I told you it was going to be real quick. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have a different opinion about this, definitely let me know. I'd like I just like to hear what other people think about it. This was 100% my honest opinion about this product. Um, as far as this lipstick, I don't think that I'd purchase it again. And I don't know if I'd purchase any other matte lipstick from MAC because of it. But who knows? Um, maybe it's just this one. Maybe. I just got a little unlucky with it. <laughs> Stay tuned guys because I got a lot of videos coming your way and I also have a request video. It's my very first request so I will be doing that too and uh, once again thank you so much for watching and I will see you very soon.